Hi everybody, my name is Jean Wiegraat and welcome to my terrain tutorials. This is part 3 called Terrain Texturing. So first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna open Terrain Editing Mode. So, we got it open now. We took all the wireframe off by pressing on it. Next thing we're gonna do is add a new terrain setup layer by right clicking on this and creating. So click on this. We're gonna We've got a package and nothing. And we're gonna give it a name. Let's call it layer one setup. Next thing we're gonna do is click on this, select this, and then click on it and add a new terrain material. So we're gonna change the package to nothing, give it the name. Let's make this one a dirt. Dirt one. Okay, so we press on this arrow. And after that we click on this. As you see the material is now put on none. What we want to do is open our content browser, find a material there, select that material, click on the screen arrow so that the material is combined with this terrain. So that's what we're going to do. We press on View, Browser Window, Content Browser. Next thing we're going to do is click on UDA, UDK Game, select Materials, type in Search Dirt, and select this dirt. After we select it, it gets a yellow square around it, so you know it's selected. If that happens, Press the green arrow. This might take a while, but not too long. As you see, the material is now placed on my terrain. To make an extra layer, I'm gonna close this one and add a new new terrain setup layer. We call it uh, layer. Setup. Press OK. Select it. Right click on it. And add a new terrain material. We call this one. Rock. One. OK. Click on this arrow. Also click on this box to see this. I don't know why that is, but it happens. It helps a lot. Click on it and search again UDK game materials. This time we type in search rock. So we get a rock texture or a rock material. Let's take this one. Press the green arrow again. Wait a bit. Okay. So this is the thing different from the first layer. The first layer always put this automa automatic on the whole terrain. All the layers need to be placed by hand on it. Select this layer, layer setup tool. Be sure you got the paint tool, hold control and press left mouse button. As you see I can now paint the rock material on the other material. This looks alright. This. this is how you texturing terrains. I hope you learned something from it. It looks kind of cool. I wish you good luck and see you next time. Greetings from Jan Bigerat. See you.